Hi, Tom Richardson for New England Boating, and I'm about to show you a really cool kayak from Point 65. It's called the Martini GTX Angler Tandem. And the neat thing about this yak is its modular design. That's right, it comes into three in three separate manageable lightweight sections that easily fit into the back of an SUV, in the bed of a pickup truck, or even a large hatchback. Another great thing about the GTX Angler Tandem is that it can be used as a single person kayak or as a tandem simply by adding the midsection unit. The sections fit together snugly using the patented snap tap system where the tabs slide into a ratchet on either side of the hull. There's a bit of play in the design, but we didn't notice any performance issues on the water. Both seat sections feature adjustable footrests with foot controlled rudder leads, which can be easily adjusted to fit the paddler's height. The seats are comfortable and feature a mesh-like fabric molded over EVA foam, plus an adjustable backrest that can be inflated or deflated through this hand pump for the optimal fit. The seat sections also come with a set of thigh braces for extra paddling comfort. Of course, the GTX Angler, whether in the solo or tandem versions, uh, is billed as a fishing kayak, and as such, it comes with these uh, rod holders that simply fit into the pre-mounted rod mounts on the deck and they flip up like this for easy access to your rod and the uh, the kayak also comes with a set of uh, in-deck rod holders as well on the stern. Other features of the Martini GTX Angler include a rugged roto molded hull, two watertight storage compartments, a molded in ruler for measuring your catch and a convenient paddle holder on the side. Overall we found the .65 GTX angler tandem kayak to be a rugged well-built and comfortable kayak that's uh, very easy to transport and store we also appreciated its versatility in terms of it being able to function as both a solo and a tandem kayak it's like getting two kayaks in one which makes the suggested retail price of $18.99 seem pretty reasonable i'm tom richardson for new england boating thanks for watching